Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Obviously, today's urgent question was specifically on uh, the cases AN and JM, which we have given a decision on, which I've given a decision on, and for clarity purposes for them, was not to uh, continue with the court case there. Any other issues that uh, uh, the Honourable Lady was talking about uh, is separate, and whether we move on and do other things, that is not uh, for a discussion here today. There is a, a further case happening at the moment. It would be ongoing legal case of which it would be incorrect, and I'm sure the Speaker would agree it would be incorrect for me to talk about an ongoing case at the moment. Therefore, I cannot. However, what we do know is that for these claimants upon which this UQ was granted, I have for clarity appealed it for them. Equally, at the same time, we are talking separately about the mobility issue, which I have given updates regularly to the House on what is happening there. We have been working with stakeholders to create new guidance. We have been consulting with claimants and stakeholders, and we do know that we seem to be on schedule to have the first payment to go out to them at uh, the start of this summer.